Legend of Total War here with part 98 of my Mount and Blade Warband NO Domino 1258 Let's Play Camp, sorry, 1257 Let's Play Campaign as Legend of the Conqueror. So previously we've been fighting the Polish, we've been fighting everyone, but the Ilkhanate and the Republic of Pisa have um, declared war on us to try and stop us becoming, I guess, a massive empire that we already are. I'm trying to slow us down, I guess. Well, whatever. If they're just raiding, then that's really not going to... Okay, they were, that there was just raided. If we can find that general and, and defeat him, that would be good. Alright, there they are. It's, it's, a, it's not a large force, but I want them dead. They've split up, which I guess is a smart thing to do. Come on, catch him. Catch him before he gets back there. Well, there's a few guys here. Let's approach the gates and talk to someone. What does this guy think? He doesn't like me. Oh, it's their king. He's not in his best interest to make peace, alright. Yeah, fuck off. I'm sick of hearing that shit. Why would I give you anything? Lord Baida. Let's see if they'll betray him in the presence of their own king. Nope, looks like you want to die. Alright, last one. This guy's devoted to me. I might be able to speak to him. Nope, he doesn't want to. Alright, now let's just get a calculation of, just get an idea of how many um, soldiers they've got in the city though. Okay, so 165 plus 118, so that's, just, that's close to 300. 350, then there's, oh my god, then there's the actual king himself. Um, that's, what's that brings us close to? That brings us close to about 600. That's 750 of them. thing is, this could be one of those settlements that we could uh, get the Lord's Hall it to. So it could be worth doing this. Because if we if we just go straight to the Lord's Hall, we defeat them all without a fight. Problem is, I, I can't remember and I don't know for certain. But even, even if it isn't, we've got an opportunity here to get four of their Lords and we need to take it. So if, uh, we won't be able to get them to surrender. The balance of power would be something like Battle of Avenger 4 maybe? This is a settlement in which we can get to the Lord's Hall, I know that, so we got a battle adventure 6. All they have to do is just run up there, jump down. Okay, excellent. This is a massive stroke of luck here, that we've managed to capture them in this settlement. And hopefully, because yeah, if we capture the Lord's Hall, they all lose. All 700 of their, of their soldiers die. There's a lot of them up there. The sooner I get up there, the less soldiers I'll lose. And the more glorious... The, well, it's not really a glorious victory, but the better the victory. I just want them out of my way. Excuse me, just get out of my way. Don't mind me. Okay, we've got... run home free now. Just need to get to this point here. Or is it here? It's here. So I lost a grand total of like 20 men. But I have to win this fight here. Come on, don't fucking... Man, don't put me at the back of the wall here. Ah, this is the problem with doing this against the king. He's hard to beat just on his own. Get him over. Good. Got him. And we win the battle, just like that. And all of their armies are defeated. Now, this indicates to me that now is the time to, to really press the, the war against the Polish. Now, how many of them do we get to 
to keep? I mean, how many of them do we uh, imprison? None of them. They all got away. Well, we took the settlement, but they all got away. Well, I guess that's fair in a way. Considering... Okay, hang on, hang on. Oh, no, no, it's just been raided. Don't worry about that. Let's let's take Pega Guy, which I think we can do the exact same thing to. There's not too many soldiers here. In fact, we might be able to just get the... Uh, the what's it called? Oh, god damn it. Sometimes my brain just doesn't work. Get the castle commander just to surrender the city straight away. Good. So we take the settlement without a fight. Alright then, where to next? Sierra Perilous or whatever. What was that? No, you're not getting any of your soldiers back. So they've still got a few lords out and about. So he's going to, to there. It's okay, we'll just beat them there then. No, 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 no. Don't worry about that. No, no. Come over here, you fucking idiots. Fucking idiots, a lot of them. Don't get yourself involved in something that doesn't concern us. What is that? Oh, okay, that that kind of does concern us. I guess that's all right. All right, you're my prisoner. So I guess I guess they did make a good call there. You got one of their lords. I mean, nothing. It's not a major lord, but still, um, I don't have time. I just not can't justify taking him back to. Um, Back to Verona. We'll just have to keep moving. Damn it. People are leaving France to join Ilkarnate. And Ilkarnate is now our enemies. Let them come to, to here. It's fine. Maybe we can cheat them out of this settlement. Well, not cheat them out of it, but... Alright then, let's let's do this. This castle should be pretty much the same as the other one, so we can just waltz in there, get to the Lord's Hall, and take it. See how the Polish like having this done to them. I can't see, but I, I do think it's the same settlement type as what we've, we've just managed to... Yeah, it is. So if we keep this up, Poland isn't going to have many settlements left, or any settlements left very soon. I think I'll put that Navarisi general in here as well. Bastard. Doesn't matter, just ignore them. Not not interested in fighting them. Just leave me alone. Fuckheads. They might think, why don't I just tell my soldiers not to, to move? Why don't just to hang back? Well I need someone I need them to, to circ up the fire so I can even get here. If they're all focusing on me, I'm not getting anything done. as I can whilst that guy's fighting. Good. Good, we got him. And the battle's won just like that. Good, we 
have freed him. But what about... Look could we've freed another one. We don't... Ah, oh, they all escaped, it looks like it. Ah, it doesn't matter. Or maybe because we didn't actually knock them out, even though I kind of knocked one of them out. That doesn't matter. It's just good that those guys have been freed. And of course we have the city now. Alright then, so... I mean, that's Navarra. We could take that. But I'm more concerned about getting rid of Poland right now. There's Lusk up here. Russa, or Rusa, I don't know. So they're down to their last two settlements by the looks of it. Alright, we're coming over to Rusa. Oh, I forgot to put that guy in prison. Uh, I'm not responded to... Well, can't do anything about that. So those are the lords that aren't devoted to me, the ones that are a problem. That I should... yeah. Wait, 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 what settlement? I didn't see. Was it what settlement was under siege? Oh, God damn it! I don't, I don't know what settlement can't see a report and it wasn't on there. They just like fucking, they just throw these notifications at you like, hey, don't forget this. And I was like, I'm kind of fucking busy, bitch. So, these guys, what's this? No, I'm not giving you back your soldiers because you're just going to fucking attack me with them. Are you kidding me? Are you Fucking kidding me! More mowing of the lawn. Every goddamn day, someone has to mow the goddamn lawn. People are fucking retarded. If it gets any louder, I'll pause the recording and whatever. wait for it to go away. Hmm, we could probably take that on along the way. I might just do that. It's, it's probably an easy settlement to take. Because we need to punish these guys. Okay, it's getting louder, so I'm just going to pause the recording and wait for these guys to finish. Okay, the Lord Mowing's still going, but it's, um, it seems to have moved away, so it's not quite as loud now. Okay, so... What are you doing? So Lord Zabantis is still part of my army. I thought he had defected. It doesn't matter. Maybe there's more than one Lord Zabantis. I, I don't know. Anyway, what we're going to do here, we're going to make our way to... Let them raid. To here, because I think that'll be an easy settlement to take. And it's on our way to Rusa anyway. Might as well sort of, in a sense, kill two birds with... Hang on, hang on. Oh, God, I was just going to say, before I go there, let's have a look at what they've got inside. These guys have had pretty much free reign to come and smash us lately. Okay, so... Alright, 300 of them. No, it doesn't want to surrender. That's fine. Prepare the ladders and attack the walls. So this delays us by 6 hours from getting to Rusa, but I think that'll be fine. If this is a settlement type, just like the other ones, we'll be able to get to the Lord's Hall. Do this. Oh, it's not. Which means we have to kill them all. But we've got a battle advantage of 20. We must have a lot of troops here. Well, for fuck's sake, I really don't like this map. It's not the best. Uh, I was hoping for a Lord's Hall fight. Now we're going to be bogged down here. And it's night as well. That's it always sucks. I don't like fighting at night. Not if it doesn't actually have any advantage. Like there's no advantage to fighting at night. It just makes it harder for me to see. The AO they don't they don't have eyes in the same sense that I do. 
I mean, if it was against a human player, then yeah, going up against a knight could work. Okay, so the battles... It always goes badly to begin with. Just because we're gonna get past all these fucking archers. Don't you push me off the edge. Fucking idiot, I'll save your life. Or I'll kill you if you push me off. We prioritize getting rid of these goddamn archers. Good, I've still got plenty of health. Get rid of all their archers. And we'll stop them getting a good kill ratio. That's a real strength here for the, their archers. Okay, so that's done. Alright, so 50 of them are dead. But there's still a lot more. We've got 300 and... Oh, God. It's no good to attack them there. 325 of them to kill or something. Using it, and I hate it being done on me. And it's, it's basically good for foot soldiers, it's not good for a commander to use. Alright then. Guys, kill mine. Fucking losers. Battle advantage. We should be fine. Oh, heat shield bash. Fucking, fucking stacks on each other. Which my shield bash been keeping on the ground for longer. Okay, get away. This is not a good spot here. I can't just jump down though. If I get knocked out, I will not be getting an auxiliary soldier, I think. I very much doubt it. So I'm trying to get knocked out. I mean, we've already killed about half their army, so... Well, not quite. We're almost at half their army. Alright, shit. Let me through, let me through. Let me through. Let me see if I... No, it's not gonna let me through. Get down then. Right now I can't. But he's stuck. I wonder if I jump over this way. Okay, good. Hunbo, huh? No, 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 no. Give me back my shortened military scythe. Oh, well, it looks like we're and now an archer. Anyway, I was low on stuff anyway. Let's let's see how this does. I know Mongol Bow is the best one in the game. Oh, shit. All I've got is bows. It's fucking dropped my, my sword. I can't see it. Don't tell me it despawned. Ah, oh, that was dumb. Well, I'll just do what I can. I mean, my guys are winning. Have a look at the kill ratio. Uh, it's actually that even. Regardless, it's good to just take the settlement away from them. These guys have been a pain in the ass for a while. Taking my settlements with seemingly impunity just because I'm fighting everyone else and I haven't considered them a priority.
looking good, I guess. Alright, so let's see. The battle's almost over. There's a hundred of them left. I'll just continue to shoot them. I'm getting the odd kill here and there. Is this their last wave or something? Nope, here they come. You know what, I don't think this bow is quite as good as my other one. Wait, this is the Hun bow. I think. Doesn't matter. Goddamn javelin men. Alright, so. This is quite possibly their last wave. Alright, I'm gonna get down. I don't have a sword. I mean, I'll get it back after the battle, as I should. I'd be pissed off if I don't. That looks like my regular bow, and that looks like the Hun bow. Because I think the Hun bow is very small. So where are they? There's one up there. Oh, there they are. Let's see if I can shoot them from here. Okay, one guy left. Well, they're right on top of that guy, so... Very victorious. We win here. Take a few of these guys for myself. And I'm gonna leave this guy here. Remember to do so this time, that is. Trade prisoners, alright, you stay there. Reduces his chances of escaping. Alright, now we have to move on to Russo because we gotta get rid of the Polish. Maybe we should uh, focus on getting rid of the Novgorodians as well. And, uh, for for one, uh, one thing at a time. Deal with the guys that have been the most nuisance. Poland and the Navarese, Navarre, whatever. They've been the uh, biggest nuisance. There's no one here. I lost Tarsus. What the hell are they doing in Tarsus? Good, only requires ladders. So they take a sediment, I take a sediment, whatever. I don't need Tarsus. So let him raid. Just raided. Okay, let's see if we can get him to surrender first. Nope. Well, I need wants to die then. Okay. Now, this settlement here, are we going to be able to... No, we're not going to be able to find the Lord's Hall. Okay, we've got a big battle advantage, so that's good. So I want to get up there straight away and start killing. These archer support. These cinemas are very hard to sort of get up here without any casualties. Yeah. 
focus on getting rid of their archers. It'd be easy to get rid of them. Jeez, I'm taking a lot of damage already. Jesus. Pretty down to half health. I must be using the Hunbo or something. Well, whatever the case, that's the end of them here. Yeah, it's the settlement type. I don't like the settlement type. So how many have we killed so far? 30, 40 men. Not even 10% of them so far. Fucking javelin men. Teach you a lesson, prick. And I'm not doing that well in this battle. I keep getting damaged, and damaged a lot. This is good. Okay, going up there. Probably not the smartest move, but... Gotta get rid of their archers. Fuck. It's my suicide going up there. I'll let them do it. I'm gonna break through here. Oh, I can't. I'm probably gonna get knocked out. I can't get a good shot. Okay, any more up here? Yep. Come on, come on. My armor doesn't really seem to protect me against this Hun boat. Boy, we really got smashed. No, I'm not giving an auxiliary soldier. I've got too many soldiers. Too many allies, I mean. I'm not going to give me one. So I'll just have to let my allies deal with this. Now, the thing is, this is right at the start of the battle. Doesn't seem like I'm that useful for this fight. What I'm going to do is just pause the recording and let this just go on because this is going to be boring. We're not, not going to be able to get a good angle and it's going to take a long time. So I'll just pause it until it's nearly over. Okay, well, watching over this, it appears like my guys are actually doing really well. They actually managed to push out from under, under the, the tower here, and they're out fighting them on the field here. Which is good. They've actually been getting a really good kill ratio. I mean, it would have been better if I had lived, but... I'm not complaining about this. This is good. So, about 370 enemies are dead. I mean, there's about 100 more to go. 100... 130 or something. This is essentially the Polish capital. There's one more settlement left to take after this, and then Poland's gone. Well, they're gone in the same sense as they were gone last time. No more settlements. Lack of support of the nobles. Hopefully they leave. Of course, I don't know how they managed to come back last time after being gone for so long, but they did make a comeback. However, we didn't hear from them for such a long time, which... It would be great if we didn't hear from them again. Even if they did come back, you know, just to, just to get a break from these buttholes. Okay, well that's why they're able to break through, because the battle's glitched. All their soldiers are stuck behind here. Alright, let's see here. If I, I'm going to select them, I need them to, to come over to hold this position here. I don't know if they'll... I don't know how to select where I want them to go, but I want them to... So they just get... Where are they going? I tell them to follow me. God damn it. 
Can't do anything from here, it seems. Oh, hang on. And I tell you what, that lawnmower, I wanted to give it a rest. How, how many hours a day do people spend mowing their fucking lawn? What are they even doing? Okay, I might as well just withdraw here because we can't do anything. Call cool, meaning surrender. Oh, god damn it. Uh, we should have been able to just. Stupid. This is why I hate this type of battle. It's fucking glitched like that. This is wasting our time. Polish dude over there wants to get back to the city. We're low on food, so we have to take this quickly. Call mini with the castle commander. Surrender. Nope, he doesn't want to surrender. Then let's lead the troops into the battle. And there should only be about a hundred of them tops in there. We've got a massive battle advantage. But of course we need to run up on the walls again. Hopefully I don't get knocked out so early this time. I think it's overpowered, to be honest. Doesn't matter how much armor I've got, it always works against me. And you can pretty much bang someone's shield and then they immediately use shield bash. Nobody recoil. So that should be close to half of them dead at this point. Let me jump down here. Chase these guys up and hit them in the rear. Mm, my guys are getting killed by something. Alright, well at least I'm at the rear here now. Turn this around. Right. I'll go up there and clear this. You guys prepare for the next wave or whatever. Bows. Okay, luckily there's not that many of them. Okay, there shouldn't be many left. I mean, what, there would have been a hundred... You could be kidding me. Oh, fuck, I'll be right back. Alright, I believe that the lawn mowing has stopped. Just waiting around, let's get back to this. Alright, so... There should only be a few guys left to kill. I first saw that Poland was besieging settlements again, I thought they were just dicking around that they weren't actually going to succeed in taking any settlements. Didn't think they had any support left. 
And here we are, fucking cutting them down again. We should be elsewhere. Fighting the French or the Bacanate or whoever. Let this be the end of it. I still want one more. Oh, shit. No, they're fighting those other guys. Oh, hang on. They could be stuck. Oh, wait, no, they're not. Okay, good. We've still got one more settlement to take of Poland, and then we can focus on someone else for a while. Oh, we saved Podesta de Griffey. Oh, that's great. And we freed him. That's, that's good as well. It's good that we're freeing them, but I'm sure that there's still a number of lords that are held captive elsewhere. Not that many that are, it would really affect us that much, but still. It, it is good to free them. Okay, we need more food because I'm just about out. Rotten pork, great. Well, I can sell that back to them. That should keep us going for a couple of days. So, with one more settlement left to go here, I believe, that will hopefully be the end of Poland. Th this is the end of them there, okay. And there's just a question of, do we go after um, the Na Navarre, or do we go after Pisa? Because I've got a few settlements over here. But they've taken, they haven't taken them from me, they've taken them from other people. I think. Who took that? Teutonic Order. And we can see out here that these guys are, are yeah, the, the French are being absolutely raped out here. And also, while we're up here, we could take, you know, Smolensk. Let's do it. Let's take Smolensk on our way down to, uh, to Lutsk. Because we need to get rid of the French. Oh, look at this guy. Let's, let's see if we can catch him. Bordeaux has been besieged by Portugal. Yeah, we'll never get there in time. Come on, catch him. Well, if you don't want to speak to me in private, then you're fucking dead. We've got 2,700 men. Got my prisoner. I'll put him in prison in small and scuff that we take it. They have got uh, Veliki Novgorod as well, but uh, I don't care. We've we got to be making our way towards um, getting rid of Poland more than anything. A lot of people are joining the Ilkhanate, which is bad. But they haven't besieged anything yet, which is good. 500 souls in, soldiers in here. I hope it just requires ladders. Good. It's probably the same settlement type as the previous one. We'll speak with the Garrison commander, but they never, never go for it. Whatever. Probably the same settlement type, which is a pain in the ass, but we just need to deal with it and crush them as best we can. No, you don't get your soldiers back. Yeah, it's the same settlement type. I'll do my best to try and stay alive or stay conscious the entire battle this time. Gotta get up here and get rid of those archers though. I'll just try and sneak through here. Fucking shield bash, would you fuck off? with a two-handed weapon, even with as much skill as I've got with it, it's still slower than a sword. Okay, not doing too bad. Got some longbows here or something. Got a Welshman doing all the way over here in, uh, in uh, Russia. I've lost about a quarter of my health so far. It's not too bad. I might 
might try and shoot these guys. Because attacking them head on has proven to be quite costly in the past. Now, if I want to try and survive this battle as long as possible, I need to not go up into the top part of the tower there. I do need to come here and carve them up. They can't be broken down. Right, I don't really like standing out here, but I don't really have a whole lot of choice. Looks like this army is fairly light. I'm not seeing that many heavy units here. A lot of javelins and such. Thin the mat as they come through here. Damn it. What a bitch. Fucking javelin, man. There's no place for me to get a good kill zone. Oh, good. My guy's meant to punch through to here. That's great. This is what I needed. Keep this up. Keep pushing forward. Don't let them through. Fricks. Come on, guys. That's it. Take the fight out here. Yeah, this is much better. Hit them from the flank. Now, if they're turning, if they're looking at me, they're not looking at my enemy. Uh, looking at my allies. It's a turn around, turning and looking at me, and you get smashed by my guys. Fine by me. As long as we're getting a good kill rush here, which we definitely are. Good to take the settlement away from the French. Weaken them even further. But let's not forget the Polish are our real concern right now. We've got to finish them off. I'm getting low on health. Once I get knocked out, it's not going to be quite as good. At least my guys are out here fighting, where they do so much better out here than in the tower. I'm going to last my for this rate. I don't know why they're doing so much damage to me. I mean, I've got a lot of armor. So how are we going so far? We haven't even lost 100 men yet. Ah, yeah. They've lost half their army here. So good, things are looking very nice. Fucking 
javelin mint. Try to avoid him then. So what are we up to now? 300 of them killed. I can probably afford to take one more hit if I'm lucky. It has to be a small hit. Shit, my guys let them through, sort of. Ah, oh, damn, there I go. I'm probably not going to be given an auxiliary soldier. Nope. So all those glitchy soldiers that are behind here, probably not going to be able to be attacked. Yeah, look at them all. There'd only be about 120 enemies left here, though. The odd guy's coming through. Maybe they can finish it off. It's just gonna take a while. The problem is they, they attack they're trying to attack through wood walls, they're just dumb. How do I get them to come over here? So I tell them to follow, but I think they follow where I Ah, oh, I can put it on the map. Well, I don't, hang on, put it here. God, well, you learn something new every day. That'll really come in handy, that. And then, charge. Oh man, these guys are so dumb. Hold the position over here. then charge. Yeah, hold the position over here. All along this line, over here. Come on, over here. No, no. I guess it's over here that they need to be. and then charge. There's only a few of them left. The kill ratio is not great, but it's not worth starting the... Refreshing the whole battle. Over here. Every time I press hold position, they go to the center of the map or something. Right, hold position means not get into the fight straight away, losers. Okay, there's only a handful of them left. One guy left who was back over here. Slowly going into the ground here. There he is, the last one.
Finally. Okay, good, taking that away from the French. Weakening them just that little bit more. And it doesn't really strengthen us, it's about weakening them. Oh, we haven't quite finished yet, but that's okay. How many could they possibly- I wonder, is that the Lord's Hall up here? What if we just bypass all these guys and get straight for the Lord's Hall? Let's see if that works. Oh, they're all on top of me though. Might be quicker to kill them. Let's see. Nope. Oh jeez. They were shooting me. I'm pretty sure though if I get knocked out, my guys will be able to handle the last few of these guys. Well, maybe not. Still five enemies left. It's me versus all them now. I've got one ally left. Ah, they're stuck. No problem. I'll unstick them. Right, we're done here. Now for the final bit. Come on, the missiles. Alright. Good, last one. Oh no, this one is. Got him. Good, I finally take that settlement. Don't know if there's much point taking any soldiers, they'll just abandon me anyway. Okay, we need to put this guy in prison here. It's probably not very safe here. The smallest comes under siege, They're, it'll be easily be retaken. But at least for the time being, he can't generate an army and harass us or anything. Is that a Polish guy or was it French? I think it was Polish. Alright, let's keep going. So we need to make our way down to Lutsk. So those guys are just raiding, or whatever. Who's that? A lot of people are joining the, uh, the Ilkhanate, that concerns me. Good, we got someone. Jafar Noyan. Good, we're still making some money. It's not much, but better than losing it. Okay, and here we are at Lutsk. This is their final settlement. Who's that? No, it's okay. So let's um, speak to the person. Let's see if he'll uh, if he's devoted at all. No, he's not. Alright, then I guess we have to kill him. Build a siege tower. Oh, fuck. So be it. Napoli's gone from average to very poor. That's bad. It's gonna cost me money. Okay, give them one chance to surrender. Nope. Well then, let's kill them. Now this is the last Polish settlement, but that doesn't mean it's the end of them. But with a handful of their lords currently under lock and key, they're, uh, I think they'll find it hard to regroup. So I think we're up against about 400 of them here. Nothing we can't handle. Gotta get rid of their fucking archers. 
Quit moving around, bitch. up here to shoot his arm or something. <laughs> Look at my guy there uh, trying to climb up. Giving points for enthusiasm. But minus points for stupidity. Siege Tower's not even close yet. Starting to get closer. Come on, stop moving. Fucking prick. I've used up half my ammunition just on the siege tower here. But it has really softened the defenders, that's for sure. Look at them all. All of these guys dead up on the walls there, all killed by me. Okay, that's the entire flank gone. Now for the true carnage to begin. Now, I'm pretty sure that this settlement here does not have the Lord's Hall. Like, I can come down there. It's just not the Lord's Hall. I've fought in the settlement plenty of times to know that no Lord's Hall here. Come on. I wonder, these Strellies, they seem to be a different type of arrow. But are they better than, like, barbed arrows or something? Or what do I use? Bodkin arrows. I've never seen the Strelly's been sold in the shop. I'm really gonna get rid of these fucking archers. They just cause too much damage. Problem is, I take a lot of damage in going out here to go fight them, but by getting rid of them, my guys are thereby left. Um, to fight these guys, I guess, one-on-one -on -one without, uh, you know, without getting peppered by these fucking losers. Oh, come on. A lot of archers in this settlement here, and it looks like they've all got pretty good bows. up here. Good. Now, I, I can come and check this, but I already know the answer. There is no Lord's Hall in the settlement. See? They will repopulate that tower, but it'll take them some time. In the meantime, I'm going to come and help fight. So how are we going? We've got what? This is a castle with about 400 men in it. Killed 130. So 
Seems like my guys are stuck here. Well, me to the rescue. Slaughter. Okay, looks like they're coming up from down here. I wouldn't mind trying to stop them. From the rear. How are we going now? Nearly 200 of them dead. We're getting there. jump down again, just wait for it. Just... Very nice. Now we're absolutely crushing these guys. Come up here and clear off some more of these archers before they get too many and really start doing some damage. Good, half of them dead now. I'm gonna jump on this, but then I forgot to actually jump. My guys aren't really doing a very good job on this battle if they're getting stuck again. By the time I get there, we're just about over. Well, if I can just get one kill, or even a few more than that, even. All right, where to go next? I'm gonna jump down here. Oh shit! That wasn't the smartest move. Possibly going to get knocked out. Maybe not. Oh, fucking javelin men. Get away from them. Nope. You don't want to chase after javelin men because they don't lose accuracy while moving. Okay, 300 of them down. 100 left to go. Could be the last wave, actually. Might have overestimated their forces. Still got two left. I bet they're stuck in that position where they always get stuck. Here. 
Yeah, there they are. Down here. Okay, well, I should just be able to shoot them. Good. And the kill ratio is in our favor. We lost just a little bit under 300 men. He may have escaped, but he's got nowhere left to get support from. Uh, I don't need to be taking any soldiers. Most of my most of my troops will just come from my allies anyway. We've got two and a half thousand men here. We're right to keep marching. Okay, with that we'll end the video there. But let's just have a little look at the situation. Now, with no more territories, Poland might actually disappear this time. It's possible, but although I'm not certain. Now, the Navarese the Navarre, they are a pain in the ass. No doubt about that. I should probably go and focus on them. I mean, if we come back up this way, because it's pretty close, we just have to go from... Where are we? I don't even know what settlement we just took. Lutsk. So if we come here to Zeningorod, and just carve our way back up here, we can take all of their settlements, because they're all... They're all there. Who else is the uh, Ilkhanate at war with? Where is it? So they're at war with, they're at war with us. And that's it. So there's not that many factions left. Probably down to about a little bit more than a third of, of the original numbers. France has no real strength left. Same with Portugal. I mean, they have they still besieged Bordeaux? Or they, uh, they're still under siege, but I don't know if the Portuguese will continue with that. All I can do is hope that these guys just mop them up and just finish them off. And same with these these um, Hafsi guys, finish off the French. We'll get our comeuppance against them, so they're, they're down here. Novgorod's down here in Tarsus. I won't worry about them too much right now, though. Not really a huge threat. There's a lot of stuff out here we need to go and kill, but I think the situation's been good. I mean, the Ilkhanate's not as big as it used to be ever since we kicked them out of Europe. Well, they've got some standings in Europe. Anyway, that's the end of this episode, so like and subscribe. Part 99, I think, is next. And don't forget to visit me on Facebook. See you next time, fuckers.